しゃいませ I knew he was hungry. I told you. You said you live in an orphanage. Yeah. Is your mother really in this city? Maybe. That's what her letter said. But I've never even met her. So what are you going to do now? Is there anyone you can go to around here? Is my mother and my aunt Yumi, so. Yumi? Yeah, she's my mother's older sister. She always gave me letters from my mother. Hey, you all right? I'm tired.
Hmm. Poor girl must have been terrified to have seen such a thing. Yeah. Reina, can you fix her something to eat? Okay. Mister? Hi there. Where am I? This is my place. Nice to meet you, Haruka-chan. That's Reina, a friend of mine. Hey, what happened to that puppy? What? That puppy. I hope he's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm, I'm sure he is. Really? You mean this puppy right here? Yay! Oh, hello, puppy. <sighs> I thought I'd never see you again. He followed us. <laughs> he looks so happy. Haruka, before, you mentioned something about an Aunt Yumi, didn't you? Yeah. She was the one that brought you the letters at the orphanage? Yes, that's right. She's a real nice lady, Aunt Yumi. She stops by Sunflower Orphanage every month to drop off letters from my mother or give me toys. What? Huh? Did you say Sunflower Orphanage? Yeah. And your aunt's name is Yumi. What's wrong? What is your mother's name? Mizuki. Huh? Do you know her? Do you know my mother? Please tell me, where is my mother? Where is she? I don't know. I'm looking for her too. And Yumi as well. Haruka, do you know where Yumi lives? No. I see. Hey, mister, can I come with you? Please? That place we were just at? I was hoping to find a clue to your mother's whereabouts. I have no leads now. I know. I know where the bar is. Aries, right? Are you sure, Haruka-chan? Yes. So now can I come along? They won't let me in if I go by myself. Please, mister? All right, you can come. This is it, mister. Let me do it. What are you doing? Mr. Press button 60. Um, okay.
Hmm, I would never have guessed. A pin number. My mother told me. She wrote about it in a letter. It's one of the bar's special secrets. Haruka, why do you live in an orphanage? How would I know why? Your mother knows that you're at Sunflower Orphanage, doesn't she? She said that she can't come to get me. I asked her why a million times in my letters, but that's all she told me. That's what Yumi told you as well? Yeah. The last time Aunt Yumi came... She brought me something, from my mother. But at that time I thought, I would... I would never get a chance to meet my mother. Kazuma-san, I presume, from the ex-Dojima family. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Hayashi, from the Omi family headquarters. I've heard a lot about you. The Omi family. So you were sent by Nishiki, right? You've been looking for me, haven't you? Actually... Your phone's ringing. Please don't hesitate to answer. Hello? It's Dante. Kazuma. I found out who stole the 10 billion. It was Yumi. Your Yumi. She took it. What? So, you're after Yumi and Mizuki. No. Actually, we're here for the girl. Me? Why her? <laughs> like I'm going to tell you, I'm one of the Omi family. Kazuma-san, why don't you cooperate and hand over the kid? You expect me to do that? <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, I don't want to have to kill a man like you over a little girl. You talk a lot of shit, but can you back it up? What? I think you'll find it. I don't die so easily. <laughs> this is the Kazuma-san I expected. 
I guess there's no other choice. Go! Kill this arrogant motherfucker! Mr. Why? Why are the bad men out to get me? Why? Please tell me. I don't know. Not yet, at least. So, Yumi's little sister Mizuki runs that bar Ares. It's a good bet that they're in this together. And Haruka is her daughter. Even after Yumi went missing, she'd go visit the girl from time to time. Uh huh. Sorry to bother you, Kazuma. Can you get that? Oh, and be polite. Hello, Serena. Um, Anaki. Is that you? Shinji? I'm glad I got a hold of you. I've been trying so hard to reach you. Sorry. So, what's going on? Actually, right now, I'm on the run with Fuma Uyabun. What? After he was shot, I took him to the hospital. But he's still unconscious. Anaki. From what I can figure out, it looks like the Tojo clan put the hit on Oyabun. If they find out where he is, they'll definitely try again. Where are you right now? I've still got men setting up a safe house for us. I'll get back to you once we're safe. Contact you at Serena? Nah. I gotta sell.
the fuck out of here. We don't need no Yakuza. You deaf? Fuck off! Aren't public restrooms open to everyone? Motherfucker! Yes? Yes? That's correct. I understand. Okay, let him through. This way. Follow me, Kazuma-san. So, you know my name already. Welcome to Purgatory, Kazuma-san. Kazuma Kiryu, you don't waste any time. Right out of the pen and straight into a ruckus. I take it you're Kage. What do you want to know? I want details on the 10 billion yen stolen from the Tojo clan, and also on two sisters, Yumi and Mizuki. Some cash might help jog my memory. How much is it going to take? <laughs> that kind of information costs. I have men set up everywhere. The color of the hostess's panties. Shady deals. Unsolved murders. Eventually it all gets back to me. I piece it together like a grimy jigsaw puzzle. Then provide the precise details requested by my clients. That's why the information I provide is so expensive. Get it? I don't have the money now, but I don't have any time, either. Oh, I know. Hey. Wait. Ten years ago, the name Dragon of Dojima was very formidable. I hate the fucking Yakuza to death. Still, informants tend to be warriors. <laughs> It's our fucking hobby. So I'm really intrigued to see how you're gonna try to fuck the entire Tojo clan. So you're... Still, I am a businessman, so I can't set a bad example by just giving you information. I try to be fair, see? So? I got work for you. 
work that only the dragon of Dojima could do. Exactly. Our customers are rich bastards with too much money, and freaks who get off on blood and violence. The fighters can either kill or be killed. So this is... purgatory? And death's door is just around the corner. So what is this work that only I can do? You have to win three matches in a row. If you can do that, then you will have earned your information, Kazuma. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a special guest today. Ten years ago, this man, known as the Dragon of Dojima, killed his own boss in cold blood. He's an honorless Yakuza straight out of prison. Kazuma Kiryu! And in the other corner with two wins, a fugitive from the United States. He's wanted for first-degree murder, Daniel Feldman! As always, there is no time limit and no rules! The winner is Kazuma Kiryu! Proving that he is indeed a true gangster. And now, for the next match, the ex-middleweight world champion of Muay Thai, Kaikwan Plavuk! Can Kazuma Kiryu defeat an entirely different fighting style? You can cut the tension in here with a knife. Now, fight! Unbelievable! Our special guest cannot be stopped. Well, here we go. It seems that the next challenger has just been decided. We have a special surprise. Our champion has returned. For the past three years, this true warrior has been undefeated. Coming to you from the underground fighting pits of Las Vegas, Gary. Buster Holmes! So, we meet again. Bet you wasn't expecting me, Cosmo san You gonna squeal like a bitch, motherfucker. Let me ask you something. Do you even listen to yourself when you open your mouth? Undefeated gangster versus undefeated pit fighter! This is the fight of the century! Now, 
The gangster did it! He has defeated the invincible Buster Holmes! Standing before me is the new champion! Now for your part of the deal. Relax. I'm a man of my word. I told you I'd play fair. Yeah, what? Oh, I see. You have a visitor. Visitor? Let's check it out. Hold on. What? What the?
What is this? I can imagine you're surprised. This is the real purgatory. Five years ago, the Tokyo Metropolitan Police Department installed 50 surveillance cameras in Kamarocha. Supposedly used for counter-terrorist purposes, but they haven't been working properly. Anyways, I've been watching everything that goes on in this town with my 10,000 cameras. Hey, show us the visitor. Yes, sir. Date? Is that blood? What happened to him? Let's retrace his steps, shall we? Cue up all the footage we took of this guy. Date. Looks like his life finally went to shit. You know Date? Boss, this was ten minutes ago. Hmm. Shit! Boss, we've got trouble. What is it? I'm switching to the live feed. Kazuma. Date is in trouble. Hey! Detective! I'm sorry. Haruka's been... I know. Hey! He's a fucking pig! Yeah, kill him! That fucking pig? He's the one that busted my ass! That's enough. Fuck that! I'm gonna beat this piece of shit cop to death! Fuck off, you bastard! We're eating roast pig tonight, boys! Kill his ass! Yeah! Put him out of his misery! I suggest you listen to me. I suggest you blow me! Why the fuck would we listen to you? <laughs> What's your problem? What are you gonna do about it? Kazuma, stop. You all wanna kill him so bad? You won't mind coming through me first. You're gonna catch a feet down. You'll end up down. Don't let him through. You're very strong. It's you. Kage in Purgatory. It's been a long time, Detective Date. Kazuma? The car that was carrying the girl stopped at the batting cage. Don't worry. I'll put this info on your tab. Thanks. You know he's an ex-cop. He was selling confidential information on the black market. I was the one who busted him. He disappeared after that. Can't say I'm surprised to find him here. Kazuma. The Majima family. They took Haruka. Majima family?
of all the people, Majima. <sighs> Long time no see, Kazuma-chan. Ah, delightful to see you. It just fills me up with joy. Face to face with the dragon of Dojima. We can cross swords and have a real fight. Right? Kazuma-chan. You know what I mean. Don't you? <laughs> this is the part where you're supposed to laugh! Laugh, you stupid motherfucker! Cut it out. Huh? Where's Haruka? Uh, oh. oh. Whatever. Go ahead. She's in that room there. <laughs> I told you, didn't I? Kazuma chan. All I want to do is fight you. That's all. You can't be serious. But I am. I'm always deadly serious. Come on. Let's do this. You think you can take me, Kazuma-chan? Get ready. To get fucked up! Always, you're tough as nails. I knew you were, Kazuma-chan. 
but I'm not finished yet. It's over. Give me Haruka back. Fucking idiot. What? Die, Kazuma! <laughs> no! Oh, you boon! Why? Kazuma... ...is my friend. You stupid... ...fuck! Only I get the privilege of killing him! Majima! Oyabun! Oyabun! Oh no! Hey, call the ambulance! Hurry up! Yes, sir! I am! Mister? Haruka. I was scared. So scared. Sorry I'm late. I apologize, Haruka. I wasn't able to protect you like I should have. Must have been terrifying. It was. They tied me up and I was locked in a dark room. But all of a sudden I started to hear people fighting outside. Then someone untied me and told me to run. Someone? Who was it? I don't know. When I thanked him, he asked me if I had the pendant. The pendant? This one. Aunt Yumi gave it to me. Where's my mommy? Why won't she come see me? I'm sorry. No, I... I want to see my mommy. Please, Aunt Yumi. Please let me see my mommy. Please. Listen. What? I brought you something. This is the pendant your mother wore. Mommy's? That's right. She wanted me to give it to you. And to tell you to keep it always. Okay? Okay. It's very precious to her. So I don't want you to tell anyone about it. It's your very own precious little lucky charm. So, that pendant, he was trying to get it, huh? No. He told me to take good care of it, and that it's worth 10 billion yen. Let me see that. It's locked. We have to break it open. No! No, don't! <laughs> Just kidding. Haruka, the man that helped you, do you remember what he looked like? I don't know. It was really dark. But the man told me to tell Mr. Kazuma about the pendant. He said my name? Yeah. I wonder who the hell it is. I have no idea. One thing's for sure. We seem to be at the center of this shitstorm that's been kicked up recently.